Hey Potheads, welcome back to some Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Chamber of Azkaban Phoenix something or other that was half assed. Whatever, we don't care, we're just gonna go find Neville's Toad before we forget about it. <laughs> See what I did there? Anyway, apparently he's around here somewhere, in fact. Is that him or is that just a chocolate frog? It was supposed to be near the uh, the greenhouse. That was super, toad. super easy. He'll be happy to see Trevor again. He will. He won't be that happy though that he won't let it escape again. I'm sure, or you know, lose it. But there we go. We have his toad, which means uh, I think there's only one more item left to find in the game. Uh, so I would I would just assume that we are getting quite close to the end. But still, no Quidditch. Um, oh, crap, you know what I just remembered? We've still got to find some ingredients, haven't we? Are we going to find some more ingredients for Snape? Hmm. Anyway, I think we can end the day, so uh, let's, let's do that if we can, please. Yes, we can. And we did very well in the Incendio Challenge. We got, uh, we got an A, so look at those points, man. We are so far in the lead. Poor old Hufflefuck, only on 86. Gryffindor, looking mighty fine. 195. Bloody hell. And Ravenpaw, only 82. They're behind Hufflefucks. Holy shit. And the Slitherdicks, with a not really respectable 105. They're, everyone else is slacking so badly. I I remember when it was actually difficult to win the House Cup in uh, the PS1 game. Or at least I thought it was back when I played it. But in these in these games, these later ones, it's it's actually super fucking easy. And it is night time. So, the obligatory stand still and listen to the music for a second. Because it's super nice. Right. Um, see, where the, there was a chest here and it's disappeared. I know we opened it, but... What is it with the chests in this game? Some of them seem to respawn, some of them disappear. I don't quite know. Right, what are we doing tonight, anyway? Oh, right, Hedwig. You're a real hoot at parties, I'm sure. <laughs> Dear Harry, I heard Professor Snape ask you to find some moondew for your potions class. I can't believe he would ask such a thing. Moondew only comes out at night and it's found deeper into the Forbidden Forest than is safe for a first year to go. Meet me in my garden tonight and I'll take you to where it grows. That way you'll be safe. Hagrid. Oh, thanks, Hagrid. Yeah, well... Typical Snape sending me on a super difficult and dangerous task. Hey Neville, I got you a toad. Thanks for finding Trevor for me, Harry. I really appreciate it. Have a wizard card. Oh, thanks, pal. Shouldn't you be in bed? I assume it's pretty late. Uh, what's he going? What's he giving me? What? What? What did he give me? Did he give me Burdock Muldoon? I Burdock guess he did. Muldoon. I got three of the bastards. Close the book. Whatever. Alright, what else do we need? What's the final item? Lost. Wizard's hat fell off during a broomstick ride to the Quidditch Stadium. If found, please return to this notice board. Well, gee, I wonder where that's going to be. Uh, right, okay, cool. Hey, guys. You going to follow me off to Hagrid's hut? Be careful, Harry. Hmm, that makes me think you're not going to follow me. Hagrid's bound to be in his hut. Well, no shit. He said in the le... Well, then again, they didn't see the letter, so I don't know. Um, we could stop off at Fred and George's, but I don't think I've got any fucking beans. I don't think I have... How many beans do I have? I have four. I have four fucking beans. Well, no. No, no. Right then, off we go. Um... Yeah, what, what was I, that? What? There's prefects out now? I'm sure I heard someone sneaking around. Son of a bitch! You didn't even see me. Ah, oh. 
God, the game just loves surprising me with random prefects. How the fuck am I supposed to get past this dude? I have you. No, you don't. No, you don't. How does well, that? Well, Harry Potter. Harry Potter. Uh, yeah, you got quite the catch, didn't you? Ah, oh, son of a whore. Well, you know what? Screw you. I ain't going past you. I'm gonna use a shortcut. New, 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 new. Eat dick. This is definitely the way to go. I love these passages. Right, so we're gonna get some moon, moon dew, which uh, yeah, Snape wants. Did he want any more freaking ingredients? I don't remember. Well, I guess we'll find out when the when tomorrow comes. I'm sure that'll be potion class day. Locomotive. What? Gotcha. Eat my ass, prefects! Why is the two of them? What a load of horse bollocks! How the fuck am I supposed? That's impossible. Wait, just run, just run, Harry, run, run, run. run. I must see Hagrid in his hut. I must see Harry, Har Harry. <laughs> I must see Hagrid in his hut. Don't worry, we made it. We made it. There won't be any any fuckers on the grand staircase, so at least there better not be. Oh, I bet they're going to be in the main hall, though. <coughs> the entrance hall, sorry. They're totally going to be there. Oh, dear. Well, at least, again, at least we're not losing house points like we did in the second game, because that was ridinky-donkulous. Oh, yeah. Look who... Yeah. Fuck's sake. Is it just the one, though? It's a Slytherin one too. Run, Harry, run! There better not be anybody in there. There isn't anyone. Come on! Yes. Yo, oh, gee, that invisibility cloak would suit. You know, actually, would it be useful? To be honest, it, the prefect saw me anyway. Ah, right. Hagrid's hut. There he is. So far away. I wonder if, um... Actually. I wonder if we should pick up the wizard hat on the way to the Quidditch Stadium, which is... Is it that way? I think that's the way. Let's have a gander for the wizard hat. On the way to the Quidditch Stadium. Oh, no! Ghost dogs. Can't remember what they're called. Guy trashes? Shit, have I just remembered what they're called? Seriously? They might be guy trashes, you know. Which would be amazing if I've remembered that. Is this not the way to the Quidditch Stadium? Or is it the other way? Is it to the right of Hagrid's hut? Oh, I thought it was this way. Hmm. I wonder if I can use my broom at night time. Looks really nice at night time, by the way. Um, unless it's in the forest, which is super spoopy, when it's very dark, I can't see anything. Hmm, hmm, unless it's that door. I forget, they change the location of the goddamn Quidditch Stadium all the fucking time. Is this... I thought this was, like, the way to the Forbidden Forest, but... Well, I don't see any wizard hats. We'll have a look during the day, maybe. Maybe it'll appear easier to see or something. Let's just go see Hagrid. I bet he's just stood there watching us run about like a pillock, wondering what the fuck we're doing. <sighs> hey, Haggers! Is that you, Harry? No. Harry, I want to get started. No, it's Hermione. Right then. Now, listen carefully, because it's dangerous what we're going to do tonight, and I don't want no one taking risks. There's a unicorn in there being hurt badly by Summit. It's the second time in a week. 
if anyone dared last Wednesday. Oh. Would a werewolf be killing the unicorns? Not fast enough. It's not easy to catch a unicorn. They're powerful magic creatures. Does he say it weird? Never knew one to be hurt before. And what if whatever hurt the unicorn finds us first? There's nothing that lives in the forest that'll hurt you if you're with me. Bullshit. Right. Follow me. Bullshit, Hagrid. I am totally gonna get hurt in this excursion adventure. You cannot fool me. You ain't gonna do jack shit. And yeah, he said unicorn weird. He said unicorn. Unicorn? Who says it like that? No one says unicorn. You're weird, Hagrid, but I love you. You know, Dumbledore gets a lot of a lot of like credit for being a surrogate almost father figure for Harry, but Hagrid's where it's at, man. And he's got a flying motorbike, which is badass. Ah, of course we have a Defindo thing we can do here. Where's he going off to? Oh! We can go in that door now, can we? Right, well bear with me one moment. Defendo! Oh god damn it. Target the fucker. Defendo! Ah. I reckon that's gonna be a wizard card. Just the one. A wizard card! I uh, already got that one. Chauncey Aldridge. Very sick looking chap. Alright, let's go after these unicorns. At least Hagrid isn't sending us off on our own, though. I, I've got to give him that. Oh, are those more? Uh, more hawk lumps. Um, which way do we go, Hagrid? I want to go left. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, there was nothing that way, Hagrid. Don't you worry. Alright, let's deal with these things. Defendo! Defendo! Flipendo Defendo. Defendo! Defendo! Might as well grab them all. Defendo! Defendo! Target it, Harry. Fuck's sake. <laughs> What a weird noise. There we go. Almost feel sorry for him if they weren't such prickly bastards. Hagrid? Dude? Dude. Why are you staring at that bush? You want to be careful out here, Harry. Guy trash is sometimes rolling yes! around at night. Big, horrible dog spirits. You'd better have your Lumos spell handy to scare them off. I knew it was Guy Trashes! I am the authority on Harry Potter knowledge. Absolutely. I, there is nothing I do not know or have forgotten, ever. Uh, right, let's get me Lumos spell at the ready. Instead of the Incendio one for now. Or maybe instead... Of, well, no, we do probably need the Defendo one. Uh, if there's any more hall clumps, that is. All right. Let's go trash these guys. Whoa! Easy now, doggies. You be good doggos and just die. A lot of the boss fights are the same in this game. <laughs> Shit. Didn't do much damage to him. Oh, you fuck. Have that. Well, I'll take damage. There we go. Let's grab some frogs. Hopefully they respawn. Oh, leave me be. Have that. That's a bit better. No, Harry! Uh. It's very hard to dodge them sometimes. Whoa! Whoa! Easy Fido. Are you gonna take damage or what? What the fuck? Alright, there you go. 
eat those glorious photons. That's what light is, isn't it? Photons? I don't know. I gotta, I gotta see in science. Here we go. Nearly there. Ah, nearly there. They do a lot of damage, actually. You little shits. Have it. Take damage, goddamn you. That's one down. You little fuck. Just die. God, these things are annoying. Seems to be tougher to take down than the ghosts, but that would make sense. Am I even hurting him there? It doesn't... The health bar's not going down. Alright, come on. Yes. Wait, what? Why is he not dead? There's no health left. Come on. Come on now. You little fuck. You cannot hurt... I mean, I know ghosts are dead anyway, but... You little piss stain. Ooh. Bad do Bad dog. Why is he not dying? Just die. Thank you. Oh my Christ on a bike. Thanks, Hagrid. Yeah, don't worry, Harry. Nothing will hurt you while I'm with you. But I'm going to abandon you as soon as we get through the door. Thanks, buddy. What the f- Oh, here we go. <sighs> I mean, I expected it. Not going to be wrong. It's not like I'm surprised. Just disappointed, ha uh, Hagrid. Just disappointed. And that's we all know that's worse. That's the worst thing your parents can ever say to you. I'm not angry, just disappointed. Oh, hello. Could do some more health. A wizard card. Leopoldina Smedic. Wow. Eighteen twenty nine to nineteen ten. First British witch to referee a Quidditch match. Oh, sweet. Uh, very interesting name. I don't think I would have uh, managed to pronounce that. Thank you, Stephen. Oh, I hear more fucking ghost pricks. Oh, is that... What if we just picked up Harry? You're not going to say it? Is that what we needed? I hope so. What's through here? Oh, we're back to Hagrid. Okay, well that looks like it wasn't that big of a section then. I guess we got what we needed. And he just vanishes. <laughs> oh no! It's a unicorn! You all right there, Harry? Probably not. The unicorn's dead, Hagrid. It's in that clearing back there. What was that thing? A monstrous creature. It is a terrible crime to slay a unicorn. <laughs> Drinking the blood of a unicorn will keep you alive even if you are an inch from death. But at a terrible price. For you have slain something so pure that from the moment the blood touches your lips, you will have a half-life. A cursed life. Gordon Freeman. But who would choose such a life? Can't you think of anyone? Some say he died. Cardswallop, in my opinion. Don't know if he'd enough human left in him to die. It's Ron. Do you mean to say that that thing that killed the unicorn, that was drinking its blood, that was Voldemort? Ron Weasley. No, oh, Same. Voldemort, yeah. Let's get going. Aww. I wonder if that unicorn had a name. Can we, can we, can we drink the blood? Can we take some? I bet the horn's worth a lot of money. Aww. Oh, poor unicorn. Uh, well, Hagrid, this was fun. What are you doing? 
You were readjusting yourself? I imagine Hagrid's got quite the package. Keep your eyes peeled, Harry. Don't know what you'll find wandering in here at night. I do. Dead unicorns, creepy black robe dude, and guy trashes. That's exact and hawk lumps. Are we done? Camera, thank you. I guess, I guess we're done. Uh, we're just gonna leave Hagrid where he is. Why does I can hear? Oh, it's spooky. Right, well, I can end the night, so let's do that. That was quite a short one. I expected a longer uh, winding path through the forest. Ah, oh, the sun is shining and we've probably got potions. Yay. You mean, you know who's out there, right now, in the forest? But he's weak, he's living off the unicorns. But if he comes back, you don't think he'd try to kill you? Do you? No, I'll have a friendly if chat. If he'd had the chance, he might have tried to kill me last night. He did try and kill and you last think, night. I've been worrying about my potions lesson. I've got to learn how to mix the antidote to common poisons. I hope you've collected all of the ingredients. I don't know. Do I? Have I? I don't know. Tell me, Ron. Please. Almighty Ron of House Weasley. Tell me if I have the ingredients. I don't fucking know. Oh, well, potions class is in the dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe we have them? Will it show us if we have it? We've got Moondew. I know he wanted that. Did he want anything else? I don't know. I guess we'll just go to class and see. Because it won't let us do the class if we don't have the ingredients, probably, so... That'll be fine. Come on, then, Ronathy. Ronathan. Ronay. Is uh, Hermione already there, do you reckon? Probably. Um, I probably could trade a few more cards, actually, if we find someone willing and able. Wasn't the one at the bottom of the staircase. Oh, look, there's Jon Snow, if, if he was a woman. God, I can't wait for fucking Game of Thrones. Oh my god. April, get here now, please. Uh, can I, oh, maybe I can't trade with these guys? No, they're just sitting there. Just sitting there, chilling. I hope to god this recording's working. Just realized I haven't really tested it today, which is usually a bad thing. Who wants to trade? You want to trade cards? The Chudley Cannons are doing well this year. Chudley Cannons. <laughs> it sounds like some sort of sex act. You want to trade cards? Nice day for a run across the grounds, eh, Potter? Always. I prefer to fly, though. One of my Nimbus. You want to trade cards? Fancy trading wizard cards, Harry? Yes. Fancy trading yes, wizard I cards, Yes, I said yes. Harry? Yes. Sure. Alright, how many do we have to trade? Well, I've got three, well, three of this dude, so two of them. Gaspard Shingleton. Celebrated inventor of the self-stirring cauldron. No one stirs a cauldron like Gaspard, that's for sure. Alright. Okay. Trade Chauncey. Ooh, Lord Stoddard Withers, breeder of flying horses. Nice, nice. Oh, we have we have so many cards again. Crazy. Laverne de Montmorency, Mont Mont inventor of many love potions. Ooh, she looks like a bit of a Jekyll and Hyde. 
type deal. Okay. How many more? Quite a few. Wish it didn't take this long. Myron Wagtail, lead singer. Ah, we got the singer! Nice! That must be all of the band now, surely. Tell you what, we're, our collection is pretty extensive. There's only a few that we're missing. Celestina Warbeck, popular singing sorceress. Q. She looks like she's got soul. And all the way back to the beginning. They do. They really should have streamlined this process. But anyway, enough bitching. Roderick Plumpton. Seeker for England Quidditch team. Holds British record for fastest capture of snitch. Three and a half seconds. That was really, really fast. I hope he's not that fast to finish in other areas of his life. There's three and a half seconds. That is that is going to take some beating. Like, li literally. <sighs> Herpo the Fowl, Gulliver Pokeby, or Pokeby. Expert on magical birds. First to identify the meaning of the augury song. Augury song? No, no, no. Except, yes. Helga Hufflepuff, way one of the founders. Helga Hufflepuff. Oh, we've still got another card we can trade somewhere. Aha, number 96. For Rowena Ravenclaw, co-founder. Yeah, we know. We know who she is. Still got another card to trade. Holy balls. Now, technically, I should have two Dumbledores, but we don't for some reason. Uh, unless I'm just getting confused, which is possible. Where the hell is my last trade? Where is it? Oh, shit. Gone past it. Number 11. Gondolin Oliphant. Famous uh, for studies of life and habits of trolls. Clubbed to death in the Cotswolds while sketching. That sucks. We have five motherfucking health bars! Card, Harry. Yes! Just need to fill them now. Right, should I go looking for the wizard's hat? Before potions. You know what? Fuck Snape. He can wait. We're gonna go search for the for the wizard hat. And it might be easier just to fly on on my broom, actually, and uh, cover, cover more ground a little bit quicker than on foot. So let's give that a go. This is Snake, telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.